Yo, it's Battle Rap Corner. It's the all. Nigga, don't get put in that bag. Listen, man, we're going to talk about the super fight, man. I'm going to give you all my final predictions, who I think is going to win, you know what I mean, how it's going to go. It's a decent card. I'm looking at it right now. You got JC versus Nun Nun. JC 30. Uh, Nun Nun could pull out a round. Uh, Nun Nun is, uh, I'm not taking nothing from Nun Nun, but lyrically, he's not fucking with JC. With his energy and, and, and um, his performance... And he do have bars. He could still around. I got JC 2-1 clear. Maybe a 30. You feel me? Bill Collector versus Big T. Shout out to Big T for losing all that weight. You know what I mean? My man living healthy now. RBE stage last time we seen him versus Big K. A lot of people had him winning that battle. Personally, I had Big K 2-1. But... You know what I mean? He's back, 100 pounds lighter, 100 pounds lighter. Let's see what he does against Bill Collector. Bill Collector is, uh, he's been on, he's been dealing with some things, some personal issues. Sounds like he's battling, uh, depression here and there. Shout out to Bill Collector, man. Keep fighting, man. Everybody has some type of form of depression. For me, when I get depressed, man, I do things that make me happy. You know what I mean? Might smoke some weed. My girl, watch my favorite TV show. Um, keep keep pressing, man. You funny as hell. Keep doing your thing, man. We need you out here. I got Bill Collector 2-1 over Big T. Big T can get around, but I think Bill Collector's too well-rounded. Bars! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man, uh, Bill Collector 2-1 over Big T. Like I said, Bill Collector can punch, he can freestyle, he's animated, he's funny, he has a personality. Big T has a lot of those uh, traits too. I think Bill Collector is just more well-rounded at this point in their careers. You got Shotgun Shug versus Danny Myers. This is an interesting battle. Shotgun Shug just came off his battle with B-Dot where everybody had him losing going in. You probably got one of those situations where B-Dot, everybody's expecting B-Dot to be here. And Shotgun Shug was on the snide, fumbling his last couple battles. Everybody I was expecting beat out to wash Shug, and when Shug showed up and did his thing, I had Shug 2-1 winning that battle. Now he's facing Danny Myers. Danny Myers low-key took a little break, you know what I mean? I haven't seen Danny Myers on every week dropping a battle lately. So low-key, Danny Myers definitely took a break, maybe a month or whatever. That being said, Danny Myers has been solid, he's been on a run. Let's see if Shotgun Shug can keep this momentum he building off the B-Dot battle. But right now, I got Danny Myers 2-1, but I wouldn't be surprised if Shotgun Shug pulled it out 2-1 as well. Like, if he showed, if that Shotgun Shug from B-Dot shows up, it could be 2-1 either way. But right now, I got Danny Myers 2-1. Salute to both battle rappers, though. The main event, Geechee Gotti versus Math Hoffa. They've been woofing, talking, barking back and forth for more than a year now, I want to say. You know, throwing jab. The battle didn't happen for numerous reasons. I don't know. I'm, you know, I'm not on the inside. You know what I mean? But then it happened. Math was talking about how the URL has been protecting Geechee Gotti from him. Well... And Mav couldn't perform on the URL stage because he had something going on with Beasley at the time. Well, all that's been squashed, apparently, because we just seen Mav on the URL barking at Sue Surf. And then they did the face-off, and they announced the Geechee Gotti battle. It's the battle of the tough guys for me, man. It's like, you know, Mav is legendary for being a bully and barking on niggas and getting into scuffles and things of that nature. And Geechee Gotti is like... A bully now, man. He be barking on niggas. He has, they both got street credibility, believability. You know what I mean? I think this is going to be a classic. But if I had to pick a winner, I'm going to pick Geechee 2-1. He's been more active than Mav. You know what I mean? Like Mav, you know, been doing the legendary, uh, the legends only battles. His last bat battle against Jag was a debatable battle. Even though I had him winning 2-1, it was a debatable battle. And let's face it, Jag is dope, but he still has room to get better. Um, and Geechee been fucking niggas up, like, for two, three years straight. So, I got Geechee Gotti winning this battle, uh, 2-1, but I'm, don't be surprised. Don't count math out, like, you know what I mean? This might not age well. Don't count math out. I think math could easily win this battle. It feels like, you know what? Math 2-1, yo. Math been wanting this battle. Uh, he been talking hella shit. He ain't like he's been battling every week. You know what I mean? Or every month or whatever. Not nothing wrong with that, but he, he probably got some shit for Geechee. You know what I mean? Their their uh promotion's been crazy back and forth. Uh, I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with Mav two one. 
Um, but 2-1 either way, really, man. I hope the culture wins. I hope they put on. I hope they have enough aggressive, you know, enough aggressiveness where to we're like, oh, oh, oh. But, you know, they're both professionals. And um, I hope they keep it clean. But they're going to get up there and they're going to do their things. But I got math 2-1 now, man. I was going to go with Geechee, but now that I'm thinking about it. I mean, Geechee battles a lot. Geechee, Geechee is fire. I think Math might have something for him. So, I'm going to go Math 2-1, but it could be 2-1 either way, man. I just want to see a good battle. Y'all make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, share. Follow me on Twitter at BR Coroner. You know what I mean? Um, Instagram at uh, BR Autopsy Report on Instagram. Um, make sure y'all go check out that new video. Um, with uh, easy to block captain this and DT Rex man shot by your boy you know battle rap corner man shout out to easy to block captain too man gutter city man um, I've been I was reaching out to a lot of motherfuckers about shooting videos for them and you know what I mean niggas was you know I understand like they like oh where your new work at I've been shooting videos for 15 years I just took a little break to you know I get my mind right upgrade my equipment things of that nature so a lot of people was asking like yo where your new videos at? And I'm like, damn, these are old. These are like eight, nine years old. But trust me, when I put some new shit out, it's going to be fire. A lot of niggas ain't want to take that chance. So shout out to Easy the Block Captain for taking that chance on a nigga. Let me shoot this video. It's out now, man. Save that. But it's your boy, Battle Rap Corner. We're going to see Saturday night who gets put in that.